A big change coming for students and families in South Kansas City at an elementary school. Starting this summer, Ingalls Elementary students will go to year-round school. A major change approved by the Hickman Mills School Board two weeks ago without any input from parents. Fox 4's Shannon Russo spoke with them tonight. Some of them are not happy. The district sprung this decision on parents just four months before it takes effect. We were set to meet an interview with the superintendent after tonight's meeting, but he didn't show up. When we tried to speak with other district officials on camera about all of this, they declined and deferred us to the superintendent. A summer of fun, now a summer of learning for Ingalls Elementary students. I don't want to do this. I, I really don't like it. We don't get to have our summer. Students and parents both upset with the change taking effect for the 2023 to 2024 school year. The Board of Education giving the thumbs up just two weeks ago as the district says it will improve student performance and eliminate learning loss over the summer. Yeah, they should have started next year, give the kids time, something like that. Ingalls is the only school to implement this change, but the district says it could happen at others in the future. K through fifth graders will go to school an extra 32 days from June 12th to August 3rd, with a couple of breaks before the regular school year starts on August 21st. It's taken away from family and people that have plans already. I think it is a terrible idea. The $1 million change will bring in new staff members and shrink class sizes. The district saying teachers in district started applying for a transfer this week to work a year round schedule. However, officials did not say if that means a pay raise. I still think it's a terrible idea. Um, they still gave us the runaround. We, we still don't understand or get why. And parents can file transfer paperwork to try to go to another school in the district, but it's unclear if all of those would be approved. The district saying tonight Ingalls is its lowest performing school and that this could not wait another year to take effect. In Kansas City, Missouri, Shannon Russo, Fox 4, working for you.